Hey, there's my favorite employee. I didn't mean to startle you, sweetie. It's okay, darling. I thought you might have been used to me by now. I've been coming up to you, gently flirting with you for months. It sure is busy today. You look scared. I'm sorry, sweetie. Be a good boy and take a couple of deep breaths, okay? Good boy. I'm so proud of you. Are you willing to tell me what's on your mind? Excuse me? They did what? I'm gonna find them and kill them for being mean to my darling. <clears throat> I'm sorry that happened to you, sweetie. You're such a sweet man. You don't deserve people being mean to you. Especially for something as ridiculous as a popular item being out of stock during the holiday season. I suppose it is that time of year. The holidays are rough for you, aren't they? Oh, sweetie, you don't have to be embarrassed. Actually, you know what? Why don't you quit and come home with me? Come on, silly. You know I can afford you. I'm very rich. I could be like your sugar mommy or something. Are you flustered? <laughs> That's adorable. You already know how cute I find you, sweetie. You won't be a burden for me. I want to take care of you, darling. I want to provide you. I want to do everything for you, cutie. You won't have to be here anymore. Rude customers, the holiday rush, the constant Mariah Carey on the radio, all of that will be things of the past. You can just stay home and be my good boy. What do you say, cutie pie? Wanna do it? Oh, thank heavens. <sighs> I'm so proud of you for being brave. Let's get you out of here in such a way that you're not going to come back. Hmm? Who are you? Oh, he's giving me no trouble at all. Excuse me? How could you say that to him? He's a good boy, and it's a good thing he's quitting today to not have a boss like you. Holy shit. I have been a customer of this establishment for so long and spent thousands of dollars here and will no longer shop here after you've been so rude to my good boy. Yeah, he's quitting and coming home with me. Right, baby boy? See? Now let's get out of here, love. Are you okay, sweetie? I never realized how horrible you were being treated, baby boy. You know you don't deserve that kind of treatment from management, right? It's okay, sweetie. I got you now. You won't have to worry about anything anymore. You're still so shy with me. So adorable. We're almost home, sweetie. You have everything you want with me. I'll make you forget about the holiday season rush at work. Or, I guess your former job now. I've got plenty of money, sweetie. 
that could provide you for the rest of your life. I promise you, you won't have to work another day in your life. No more crazy holiday seasons. December's such a rough month for you. You don't have to worry about any of that stuff anymore, cutie pie. I'll take care of everything for you from now on. I'll even have everyone who hurt you there dealt with. I have plenty of connections that can take care of them. They'll regret ever daring to be mean to you, my love. Goodness, you're so sweet. Too innocent for this cruel world. You deserve so much more, sweetheart. I'm sorry you had to deal with so much chaos. Here we are, sweetheart. Let's get you some good food. How was your dinner, sweetie? Good. The chefs at the mansion are amazing, aren't they? They didn't talk to you too much, did they? I want you to feel comfy, and I know you're not best socially, so I'll make sure they don't bother you too much, sweetie. Okay, good. I'd honestly be jealous of them talking to you. You're my good boy. You're so sweet. I'm gonna love you forever. Oh, darling, listen to me real quick because this is very important. I need you to follow some rules. You're gonna be my good boy. You need to do what I tell you or there's gonna be some punishments. Don't worry too much. However, the punishment will be tying you up here if you're naughty. It's okay. I know it sounds scary. You're gonna be good for me, right? Good. You're not gonna be punished unless you're bad. It's okay, darling. You're so sweet. I couldn't imagine the terror of doing awful things to you. Luckily, I know you're gonna be good for me. Well, ideally, you shouldn't leave the house unless you're with me. It's a scary world, as you know, and I'm sure you prefer to stay in anyway. Good boy. I knew you'd think like that. I'll keep you safe at all costs. If I feel it is necessary for your safety, I'll essentially ground you and put you in lockdown. Don't worry too much. I know that's easier said than done, but I promise I'll do whatever I can to keep you safe. If I have to hire more security to protect you, although I don't want them spending too much time with my good boy, I'll do it nonetheless. Oh, and you only love me. Don't fall in love with any of the staff around the mansion. I wouldn't like that. Yes, that's right. I love you, so it's only fair that you love me back, right? I suppose I can tolerate you being unsure if you love me back. You should realize that you definitely can't go back to your job there if you try to leave. Oh, and don't run away from me because I will not stop until I find you. I know that you want to be here with me. So I'm not that worried about you doing that, but I figure I'd let you know just in case. Good boy. Now, why don't you get some rest, sweetie? I'll cuddle you to sleep. <laughs> You're so flustered, so adorable. It's okay. 
I like that you're like this. You'll get more and more comfortable soon. I'll be here with you tonight if you want. Thank you. I just want to hold my good boy until he falls asleep now. It's gonna be okay. Your life will be so much better now, darling. Are you yawning? Goodness, you're already so sleepy. Well, that makes sense. You really had a long day today. So get some rest, sweetie. Good night, my good boy. I love you.